In an interview with CBS This Morning, Bernie Sanders was trying to explain to the pundits that the reason why Hillary Clinton and Democrats lost this election was because they failed to appeal to working class voters, and they just couldn't comprehend this argument, and they kept bringing up James Comey. And just when you thought that this interview couldn't get any worse, they dropped this bomb on Bernie Sanders. How long was the primary between the two of you? Did it last? A long time. A long time. Do you bear some responsibility in raising some of those concerns? Do you feel any guilt about her loss? <laughs> well, I guess if we believe that somebody who the establishment brings forward has a right to be anointed and nobody should run against her, I guess yes. Look, Bernie Sanders' response there was perfect. They're literally questioning whether or not he's responsible or feels guilty for Hillary Clinton losing because he dared to run in a primary in a democracy. Look, this is part of the reason, besides her policies, why people just don't like Hillary Clinton. It's that entitlement. It's that feeling as though, you know, she's inevitable and that she was going to be president no matter what, whether you liked it or not. And everyone in the Democratic establishment treated her the same way. I mean, you had five people run for president in the Democratic Party. That's it. Five people. And then uh, two people dropped out before the Iowa caucus. So you had three people, basically. And everybody just stepped aside and allowed the queen to assume the throne. That's not how a democracy works. You are not inevitable. You are not entitled to that position. So Bernie Sanders, I'm glad that he laughed in their face because I, I really think it's egregious and just straight offensive to declare Hillary Clinton the queen of the country. No, she's not entitled to that position. And for him to take any guilt or responsibility for challenging her, it's absurd to me. I am winning. I am winning. And really, this speaks to the media's treatment of Bernie Sanders. I mean, they saw him as getting in the way of what was inevitable, getting in the way of Hillary Clinton and what was rightfully owed to her. That is the office of the presidency. And that's not the way that America works. And if anything, voters, they recoil at the thought of a monarchy or this entitlement to being in the White House. And they voted against Hillary Clinton. They don't like when you try to shove a candidate down our throat. That's not the way that democracy works. And if you really want to live in that type of environment, then go live in an authoritarian regime. You have many to choose from. But in a democracy, we actually choose our leaders. The media doesn't just declare, declare or anoint someone a leader for us. We make the decision ultimately. So I think that this news anchor, you know, she's everything that's wrong with the media and how the media treated Bernie Sanders as this inconvenient leech that was only sucking away Hillary Clinton's chances at becoming president. No, Hillary Clinton lost because the American people did not want Hillary Clinton to be the president. We rejected her in 2008 and we rejected her again. So now, how about you learn your lesson and actually listen to people like Bernie Sanders because he would have defeated Donald Trump if he was the nominee. You are so dumb. You are really dumb. For real. Big league.